Hey, what's going on everyone? Naka here. I hope you all having a wonderful day today so far. And today, I'm actually bringing you something way different than I normally bring you. So first off, let me tell you what you're watching in the background. Sorry the first kill got cut off, by the way. It's because I started recording late, but you're actually watching a sniper gameplay that I got on Cold War. I believe my final score was 41 and 8 in TDM, so it was pretty good, and it was in the snipers only mode. My shot was definitely on in this game, so I think you guys are going to enjoy the footage in the background. And we're going to be throwing it back today, guys, with this upload. Not in the fact that this is an old gameplay or anything, and I want to be re-uploading an old video, but we're throwing it back and we're actually just doing a sit-down gameplay commentary. People don't really do these anymore. It's all about, like, live cut comms or stream highlights, and people don't really sit down and talk to the audience anymore. That's definitely something from back in the day that helped build the COD community, but it kind of isn't a thing anymore, and it's sad to see. So I'm going to try to do some, maybe revive it. I don't think I'm going to have a big chance of doing it. I don't even know who's going to watch this video. Maybe people won't even be interested in it and the video will flop and if it does oh well i'll have to bounce back and try another method so yeah what we're doing today we're throwing it back with the gameplay commentary and we're gonna be doing a story time and the story time is actually a throwback to how i got my trick shotting name on call of duty which obviously if you guys don't know i don't know how you wouldn't know but it's NECA. all right so let's get into things and we're gonna throw it way back to like i want to say 2012 yeah it was 2012 and if you were around back then you'll remember what i'm talking about when i say that everyone wanted to have an og name who was a trick shotter or even feeders everyone was trying to have that og gamer tag whether it was like just a cool phrase or like an og word or a short gamer tag everyone wanted one it was just the thing back then and I'm actually from Massachusetts, I'm from the Boston area, so you know I had to represent Massachusetts. And the way I talk, everyone always says that I have a Boston accent. Like when I was talking on the mic back in the day, on Xbox and Six Mans, everyone would always know me from my Boston accent. So I actually made my OG gamer tag, Boston accents back in the day. I'll actually see if I have any clips that I can throw up on the screen with it. My episode name back in the day was actually What's an R? I'm gonna throw up... Uh, yeah, I'll throw my, one of my old episodes back in the day right here, like a little preview of it or something. You guys can actually see that game tag in action. Damn, baby, look at you go. From head to toe, you're a ten. Have I seen you before? I'd love to talk. I just don't know how to go about it. So instead, I had to go and write a song about it. <laughs> how you doing? Tell me what your name is. A simple conversation that's usually quick and painless, but I'm sweating bullets, shaking in my shoes. The angel on my shoulder says I got nothing. Yeah, that's the good old days. I really miss those days of just hopping on MW2 as a little teenager, no worries in the world, prepubescent teenager, squeaking in a six man, going for little pistol switch glides. It was so fun back then, man. That was literally my childhood. Anyways, back then, then I started joining some teams with the name BA, short for Boston Accents. I joined like Strive, Avenge, Motion, Rocket. I had the gamer tags for all of those. And that was my alias in the community. That's just what everyone called me. I was known as BA. Like when people were reacting to my shots, they'd be like, oh, BA, BA. I'm actually going to play a clip right now. And it's a legendary reaction from my boy Calvin, aka Hobbs. You guys might know him if you're an OG, like, fan or friend of mine. But yeah, you can just hear my friends calling me BA, and it's actually really weird to hear now that I haven't heard that in years. I've been for so long now. I want to play that right now. <laughs> no, BA! And field order is nice. Ooh! <laughs> you guys just keep surviving <laughs> each other. I no. think he's choosing for guys. Oh, BA yeah, hit it! Yeah. 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 No, you did not hit my gun! BA hit it! No, BA! 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 Anyways, all these teams started ending, and I started joining teams that were shorter, like WCS and this team Noz. They were really small, I doubt anyone remembers them. So my name was NOZ space BA, and then WCS space BA. And at that time on Xbox, you could not have under five letters in your gamer tag. Like, you couldn't have a four letter, even if there were spaces in between every one. You had to have at least five letters in your gamer tag, which was weird. It just didn't work. I guess they were determined, like, two OG or something. I don't know. I think they ended up making some of them available later on, but not too sure about that. Don't hold me to it. Don't quote me. Anyways, one of my friends I used to always play with back in the day, and I joined all my teams with him, he ended up joining this team called Saint. And what you would do for that team, for your game tag, you wouldn't put the actual name like Saint in it, you would put ST before it. But with my alias being BA at the time, you already know what that means my gamer tag was. It would have been ST space BA. And if you guys are following on what I said earlier, that actually doesn't work. It would not let me make that my gamer tag. And I asked them, I was like, oh, can I just make my name Saint, like the full word, then BA? They said, yeah, sure. And it was taken. It was literally taken, and I was looking for variants with BA. I was gonna do like I3A, cause that kinda looked like a B. It just looked terrible, I didn't wanna do it. And I was like, 
I think I need to come up with a new name. And then it hit me, guys. You remember what BA was short for? It was Boston Accents. And when people weren't calling me BA back in the day, they were calling me Accents. It was just kind of like one of my other aliases in the community because people didn't want to say Boston Accents, so they would shorten it BA Accents. Didn't really hear Boston that much, but yeah, it was mainly the first two. So like I said, the same game tag, you had to start with ST. And then I remembered, or then I didn't remember, I thought, what is the word accents backwards? It's ST NECA. So that was my alias. I just changed it to ST space NECA. And I actually didn't even get to make that my gamer tag when I decided that was my name. It went to my Skype name and everything, and I announced I was changing over to NECA. And I didn't even end up fully joining over because I ended up doing GS. And GSBA wouldn't have worked either. But I had already made my name NECA. Like, I already had the backup name. I didn't even have to figure out another alias. I was just NECA from there on. And then everyone just started calling me NECA and GS. I started gaining... I'm not even going to say, like... I would... Obviously, I've never get, gotten, like, any mainstream recognition off trick shotting or clout or anything. But I started to get a little more recognized in the small community. You know what I mean? And then everyone just kind of knew me as NECA. I wasn't Boston Accents or BA or anything anymore. So I just went by NECA. And then when I left GS, I just ended up changing my game tag to NECA with an H because NECA was taken, unfortunately. But then come, like, I think it was 2015, 2016. I don't remember exactly. But Xbox ended up freeing a bunch of gamer tags that hadn't been used in, like, 10 years or something. And the NECA gamer tag, the OG one, hadn't been touched. So they ended up freeing it up, and I was able to claim that gamer tag, which was so clutch. I love that gamer tag. It's the OG NECA tag. And I actually have the OG NECA Twitter as well. I would love to have the Twitch and the other, like, social medias, but unfortunately, I only have those two. Those two being Xbox and Twitter. I actually had it on Parlor as well. I don't know if you guys are familiar with that platform. I think it got shut down and, like, reopened or something. I don't remember exactly. It might just still be shut down, but I had that name on there. And then there's a bunch of other websites that have, like, flopped over the years I've had it on. But, I, yeah, I really want it on some other platforms. So if anyone knows anyone that can hook me up, let me know. So yeah, that's kind of the story. That's basically the whole thing. It was kind of a short story, I know, but it could have even been shorter, to be honest. I dragged it out a little bit, so it wasn't too short for the video. I could have simplified it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that one. If you did enjoy it, please make sure to drop a like and comment on the video. Drop a comment, let me know your favorite part, if you did have a favorite part of that story. I don't know if you could have, but hey, if you did, man, drop it down there. I'll read it for sure. And make sure to read every comment. You'll know I read yours once I leave the little heart on it. I think it's called loving a comment. But yeah, I acknowledge everything you guys say, and I take it into account when I'm making my videos. All the feedback is greatly appreciated. If you guys are new to my channel and you haven't been here before, this is the first video you've seen of mine, please do me a favor and subscribe with post notifications on as I do upload daily COD videos. I wouldn't want you to miss any of them if you did enjoy this one. You can do that by clicking the little bell icon next to the subscribe button. That gameplay was only five minutes and I definitely talked longer than five minutes so I feel like I'm gonna have to throw another one in. So if I did have to, you guys will have seen a nuclear choke I got. I died on a 29 kill streak. I can't even believe that. I'm still so butthurt about it. I was using the Milano. It wasn't a sniping gameplay but it was on Nuketown and I was going ham. If you guys want to see more stories in the future, just more gameplay commentaries, let me know. I got a bunch of beast gameplays not gonna lie i'm kind of the best player in the game that's a total joke i'm not i have no ego and i'm kind of trash at cold war but i try i think i get some pretty good gameplays so if you do enjoy them let me know and i'll definitely do more i can tell stories about my time in the community or maybe even tell irl stories eventually also i noticed my camera is flickering right now i want to have that fixed soon i said a few videos ago that i was ordering a new camera and i did do that i have a logitech c922 on the way so i cannot wait for that quality of my videos is going to improve so much once that comes in like i can't even imagine guys i'm so hyped but yeah that's gonna be everything for today i'm done rambling thank you so much for watching i'm gonna be back tomorrow with another banger upload so i look forward to seeing you guys then it's been neca peace out everyone